What's going on guys? My name is Mark Wagner and today I'm going to be showing you how you can make an insane amount of money on Black Friday by standing out from the tons of competition that you're going to have. Let's get into it. So the first thing that you're going to want to do is start running ads Monday or Tuesday, maybe even the weekend before Black Friday because everyone and their mother is going to be running ads on Black Friday and you really need those days before to solidify your presence since you're going to have a lower budget. The second thing that you need to do is utilize huge discounts. On any other day, people are going to think that 80% off or free plus shipping from a site they've never heard of is scammy, but on Black Friday, they're going to think it's the best thing ever. Even if your margins don't allow for those huge discounts, you can always mark up your compare app price so it seems like it's largely discounted. The third thing that you really need to do is have a solid email marketing strategy. You should be starting your sales the week of Black Friday and you need to let your email list know. Email them before the sale starts, when the sale starts, when this new product is added to the sale, when the sale has this many hours left, when the sale is extended. You get it. Not only that, but I would email them at least two to three times on Black Friday and Cyber Monday saying that the sale has this many hours left until it ends forever. You really need to push scarcity in these emails. The fourth thing that you need to do is go hard on retargeting. I really recommend that you use Facebook to retarget people who have viewed the product but not ended up purchasing. You can even segment that to target people who have like added the item to their cart but they haven't gone through with the purchase. For retargeting, you're going to want to use some sort of an additional discount, whether it's 10%, 15%, 20%, free shipping, whatever. Whatever you're doing, you just need to convey a sense of urgency, which brings me to my next point. The next thing that you absolutely, 100%, if you don't do anything else, do this. Implement scarcity and urgency. Think about it. If two 40 year old women will scrap and Best Buy over a TV, why shouldn't they be doing the same on your online store? The answer is scarcity. When people see your ad, they need to think, wow, if I don't get that right now, it's either going to go up in price or someone else is going to get it. And that feeling needs to be conveyed again when they get to your product page. The sixth thing that you need to do is increase your average order value. This can be done through a variety of strategies including buy one get one free, buy one get one X percentage off, or free shipping over a certain order amount. Quantity Breaks is a great app for increasing average order value because it rewards customers with a discount when they choose to order multiple of the same item. Another great app is Bold Upsell or really any upsell app. The last thing that you really need to do is take advantage after Black Friday. Not only do you have Cyber Monday, but you also have all the emails that you just gained. If you implement an effective welcome series, then you can make a ton of money. You're going to have the momentum flowing, so use that to push you through the fourth quarter and end it strong. I really hope you guys enjoyed this video and you guys crush Black Friday and Cyber Monday. If you enjoyed this video, feel free to leave a like, comment, and subscribe, and I'll see you in the next one.